What's going on, guys? Welcome to Basement Bar Beers, Beards, and BS. Today I got something marked Fragile. Ah, uh, Fragile. It must be Italian. Well, I think that says fragile, honey. Oh, yeah. That the, uh, the post office guy literally threw at my front door. It was kind of annoying. I mean, it literally says fragile. You didn't listen. So, let me grab a beer. I'll be right back. All righty. On today's episode of Basement Bar Beers, Beards, and BS, I'm going to drink a Terrapin. This one is Luau. Luau. Uh, passion fruit, orange, guava, IPA, beer, blah, 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 blah. Athens, Georgia. Anyway, let's snap into a Slim Jim. You're gonna overflow. Oh no, you're not. It smells really good. Oh, that's delightful. That's... Stand by. Oh, that's good. Wow. Terrapin. That's good. Not overly hoppy. Um, ooh. This isn't gonna last long. So I got my Fragile box that I don't know who it's from. Uh, it just says from bikercave.com from Loganville, Georgia. I have no idea who sent this to me. Without further ado. And then, like I said, it is Fragile. Um, Normally I throw this stuff over my shoulder, but it's got that crappy popcorn in it. Oh, cool. I don't want this stuff to get everywhere. That stuff is awful. No way. All right, so those of you know that I got a job just recently at Harley Davidson, um, not just any Harley Davidson, but Harley Davidson of Atlanta. And I had posted these on my Facebook page like last week, and these just showed up at my doorstep. There's there's no note. I don't know who these are from. But look, it's two little shot glasses, a little serving tray. How cool is that? No way. Look. One little, little glass. That one's cool, that one looks like Hot Wheels. You see that? Hand wash only. So it's got like little tribal flames. The serving tray, I mean, you can't have a Harley Davidson without flames on it, because rock and roll. That is gonna find a happy home at the bar. I don't know where I'm gonna put this, but it's gonna have a happy little place here at the bar. Ah! I want to build more shelves down here for all my cool stuff. I don't know where I'm going to put those, but for now, they're going to be over here in the video. So thank whoever sent me that, please send me a message so I know who, who that's from, so I can say thank you, or get you some stickers, which I know doesn't really make up for how awesome that is. That's really cool. Cheers to whoever sent that. I greatly appreciate it. I do want to let you know that I'm sorry I haven't uploaded a lot. I'm down to about one video a week. I've been trying to post uh, two videos a week, but starting a new job, you're trying to get back into the swing of things and my hours are a little different. So I'm trying to find time to post every, uh, every week twice. I'm trying to find time to post twice a week and I have slacked off. I do apologize for those of you that watch. Um, I'm gonna try to be better. I gotta make time to do this. 
I'm almost up to 9,000 views and 300 subscribers, which for a lot of people out there go, oh, it's not very many. It's a big deal to me. I can't thank you enough for subscribing and watching. So if you haven't already subscribed, please, please hit the subscribe button and the bell button so you get a notification anytime I upload new content so you can see my ugly face more often drinking beer in my basement. Or talking about my trip to Sturgis, which is coming up in August. I've made some great headway on the motorcycle, um, which I actually have renamed uh, from Blue to Carmen the Electroglide. So Carmen Electroglide. So Carmen, um, you get play on words. Thanks, Daniel Herring. I appreciate that. It still makes me laugh every time I say it. But I made some great headway on the uh, motorcycle, the Harley. I have got a detachable tour pack kit. Uh, which I'm in the process of installing. I've got about half of it installed. I scored a drag specialties uh, solo seat, which looks killer on the bike. It really smooths the bike out, makes it look much sleeker, uh, especially the solo seat since no one rides with me. I got my True Dual exhaust uh, kit installed on the bike. I also updated the tune from my Power Commander that I installed on the bike. Some of these videos I have recorded, but I have yet to upload because I've been busy and that's no excuse. So that's kind of wanted to give you some updates on that. I got some other stuff coming. I got some uh, very excited about some KST custom uh, bison. They're the bison bagger uh, handlebars, which are 12 inch. So they won't be like, I won't be riding down the street up here. They should be a nice, comfortable, right below shoulder height. Um, maybe a little bit above with the new low seat that I got on the bike. Uh, let's see what else I do. I got some cool Vans grips for the bike. I got some Street Glide shocks, which will lower the rear end of the bike down about an inch, which in my opinion, will really make the bike look so much better. Oh, I got a Senna, uh, let's see, it's the SF2, which is the speakers inside the helmet. I can't really talk to a lot of riders. It's not the, the Senna 50S, which is the really cool one with the mesh system. It is really rider to rider. You can have two helmets linked together I have it because I like that my wife can call me and I can keep in touch with her on the road that I don't have to pull over and answer the phone when she calls me. I can make it really simple and really easy and just answer the phone from my helmet or call her from my helmet and it's all voice activated. I just say, hey Siri, and it does whatever I needed to do, which is awesome. This beer is really good. I need to make another video for the basement bar tour people. My basement bar tour video has over 5,000 views. Um, I have to update that a little bit, but I'm ready to get the floor started down here. I got a new projector hung up, new screen on the wall. I got my record player back over here where it belongs. I've been starting to purge stuff out of the house, trying to clean up the mess that is our house. I feel like when there's less stuff in my house and less stuff in my life, uh, it's less stressful. So that's the big thing I'm doing right now. I'm trying to get rid of a bunch of crap out of my life. And I gotta be honest, leaving the car industry was a big part of that. I love my Volkswagen scene. I love the Volkswagen community, but I've been really happy at Harley Davidson. And I know I've only been there for like two weeks, but I missed riding motorcycles. I missed being on a Harley. I missed being around my friends that have Harleys. I missed being around some really cool people. Actually, some of them that I work with now. I get to see Tim more often. Tim's the parts manager who was a good buddy of mine when I was at uh, the other dealership I worked for. Anyway, I got some more videos coming about the motorcycle, about all the stuff that I have done to her. Uh, I'm gonna pop up some photos here of like the tour pack uh, detach kit. Here's a photo of um, it, the tour pack off the bike. I had it off in just a few minutes. I had the new seat installed. Bike looks killer. I got, oh, I got some new LED uh, headlights. I got LED fog lights. I got LED turn signals. Now on the back of the bike, I gotta start doing all the same things. I like to be seen on my motorcycle. I don't like people running over me. I also don't ride at night a whole lot. This is Atlanta. People are crazy. That's a really easy drinking beer. Gotta be honest, it's not overpowering, I really thought that with the uh, passion fruit, orange, and guava, that it would be too fruity. Definitely have a couple of these, especially when it's hot out. Man, that's really good. I'm enjoying this. Man, I'd have a lot to say about this one. It's just good, easy drinking beer. 
Well done, Terrapin. Well done. Man. Well, uh, for those of you that haven't, again, please hit the subscribe button. It uh, helps the algorithm and it helps me find more f subscribers and uh, likes and all those things. So please do all the things. And uh, thank you so much. I appreciate you guys that tune in every uh, time I post. And whoever sent me these, thank you so much. That was awesome. I would love to say thank you to whoever, whoever sent these. Cheers to whoever, who, whoever you are. Thank you. So until the next beer or motorcycle thing that I do, cheers. Have a good one. No, seriously, whoever sent this, you guys rule. I Or you person, lady, man, whoever, you, you rule. Thank you so much.